you know, I've looked at a lot of dating sites. I'm not talking about pornography. Dating sites. I'd say 95%, and, I'm talking about, and I've looked at everything, profiles and everything. I'd say 95% of the dating sites out there is vulgarity. Yeah. People now, when they write out their profile, 95% of the profiles, and I'm not making this up. I've been on the computer since 1999. 95% of the profiles is vulgarity. Oh, it's vulgarity for dating today is the norm. Normal. Vulgarity. Pictures, words, everything. Yeah. My great grandma, before she died, <clears throat> she was 97 years old. She died in 1991. And I've always known her, you know, since I was a kid. You know, she was heavy. Probably weighed 250 pounds. She was a seven-day Adventist, which you know I don't agree with, but uh, that's that's a different uh, subject. Anyway, I res I respected her for it. Anyway, she was telling us one time about the end of time revelation, about all the vulgarity and so forth and so on. Now this is probably back when she was telling us this. This is probably back in 1989. Well, she she said it. It's come true. Not I like I just said. 95% of the dating sites, and I'm not talking about pornography. I want you to get that through your, your, your skulls, your head. I'm talking about regular adult dating sites. 95% of them is dating with vulgarity. You have their profiles, words, or vulgarity. It's norm today. I know that probably blows you away. That's, that's why they call the Internet the Wild West of the 21st century. Everything goes, folks. You know, in the old West, in the 1800s, there was no law. There was a lot of vigilante. A lot of vigilante. Well, guess what? History's repeating itself. Nobody controls the Internet. Nobody. The Internet, everything goes. Hey, there's a lot of wonderful, clean stuff on there. And in that mixing bowl, there's also a lot of bad stuff. A lot of people don't. I mean, they put it out in words. It, the vulgarity is the norm of dating today. Believe me, I've been on since 1999.